What inspires you? From WFSU Public Media, here's this week's Voices That Inspire. My name is Paula DeBowles Johnson. I'm a wife, mother, friend, daughter, and community advocate. I created the Capital City Youth Development Corporation because of my commitment to youth. I was working in the juvenile justice system, and the thing that alarmed me was that girls were starting to commit crimes at the same rate as boys. And I couldn't figure out why they were committing crimes that were almost equal to boys. So I asked some girlfriends of mine after I did a little research, I said, look, I want to do a girls conference. And they were like, what? And I said, I want a conference for girls. We have no money, a one-day conference. Let's talk to them about the things that are important to us, the things that help us make it. We had 300-plus girls show up on the campus of Florida a and University, and that was our first conference. So the conference was all about girls. I established the Capital City Youth Development Corporation the next year. We did another couple of conferences, and then we expanded. My family keeps me inspired. They're the great motivators for what we do. That's giving back to the communities through our service, through our training, giving of our time, gifts, and talents. Our girls are really our North Star. I just want people to know personally that our gifts are truly not our own. We are blessed to be a blessing to others, and I want people to remember that, especially as we think about this holiday season. We may give to a favorite charity. We may spend some time with older people that may not have family. But remember our young people. There are a lot of things that they need beyond toys. I am Paula DeBowles Johnson. I work with Leon County Government, and I also am the founder and executive director of the Capital City Youth Development Corporation. You're listening to Voices That Inspire.